Hey guys, this is Sarah. We are in Tulsa, Oklahoma with the Carry the Love Festivals, and we have been going door to door doing some street evangelism. Um, as for me, I was sharing actually last night with my tour team in the bus how I was kind of disappointed actually um, after not having seen really someone come to Christ in a couple of years, um, just kind of laboring and believing for that. And today we were going around a neighborhood near the Tulsa Dream Center and met a beautiful woman. So I had to pray for her, um, her wrist to get healed after she had broken it. And before we walked away and left, after a long conversation with her and her son, um, we just felt to share the gospel with her son and explain to him what it means to really know Jesus and that um, basically any curse that someone's spoken over us, whether or not it's true or false about sin that we've done or any identity that people put on us, actually is forgiven in Christ. He took it on the cross and made us a new creation and he offers that for us. And we asked him, do you want to give your life to Jesus and receive that? And he said, yes. We got to lead him through a prayer of salvation. It was so beautiful, you guys. And after we were praying with him, he shared with us actually that he had been involved um, in gang banging and drug trafficking for a matter of years and had actually spent over half of his life or a little around half of his life um, in prison, incarcerated. And um, since he had been out of prison, had really wanted to turn his life around, but had never surrendered his life to Christ. And it was so incredible to get to see that hungry desire to get to really have a life change in him. And I was so encouraged. just wanted to encourage you guys not to grow weary of doing good because God will bring a harvest in due time. Hope you guys have a great day.